Hey everyone, it's Julio Ramon here from ICANN, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to balance the MS Pro. So for today's video, I have a Sony A7R2 camera with a 28 millimeter Sony lens. And before we begin balancing, I'm gonna point out all the different types of adjustments that can be made on the MS Pro. Now, as you can see here, each adjustment is highlighted with a bright yellow knob. Now the knob down here, this one will control the balance along the yaw axis, which controls your pan movements. This knob right here adjusts the height of the base plate, which balances out the camera along the pitch axis, which controls your tilt. Now, if we flip this towards the bottom, you'll see two knobs. Now, the one on the back here, this moves the quick release plate system side to side, either left or right. Now, this is gonna balance out your roll axis. And finally, the knob located near the center, this controls the quick release plate. It allows you to slide the quick release plate forward or back and lets you remove it as well. Now that we cover that, I wanna point out that the quick release base plate system has arrows printed on the base plate to indicate which direction you need to mount your camera. As you can see here, the arrow is pointing in. Now if we flip this around, the arrow will be pointing out. This is wrong, this is the wrong direction. So if you ever see this, flip it around, make sure that the arrow is pointing in and you have your MS Pro facing in the right direction. And as you can see here, the quick release plate also has an arrow printed on it. So when we mount our camera, we wanna make sure that the arrow is pointed in, which will allow us to mount the camera. So that being said, let's take the quick release plate and mount it to the A7. Okay, so we'll flip this over. We'll take the quick release plate. We want the arrow to be pointed towards the back of the camera. So we will flip that around. We will mount that in place. Now the position of the quick release plate is also pretty important. You wanna make sure you have a nice, you find a nice balance between the camera body and the lens. So this position here looks to be about right. We can eyeball this a little bit. So we will tighten down the quick release plate. Now that we have the plate attached, we will bring the MS Pro back. Make sure that our center knob here is open and we will slide the camera in. And once you hear that click, you know that you're in. Now, what I like to do here is I like to lock down the quick release plate, make sure it doesn't move. And we'll make our first adjustment. Now the first thing you wanna do is you wanna make sure you get the camera body as close as you can to the pitch motor. So you wanna slide it as far right as you possibly can. Now, as you can see here, the weight is leaning way too much on that side. So from here, we can start to inch the camera body slowly to the left until we find our balance. So, we will unlock the bottom yellow screw, and now we can slide our camera side to side. We will slide it over. Now right now, you can see the camera's falling back, so, we're gonna to have to make another adjustment. 
since the camera is falling back, we need to slide the camera up forward. So we can reopen the center knob that controls the quick release plate and we'll slowly push the camera forward until we're balanced. So slowly. And it looks like we found a balance. Okay, now that we have everything locked down, we have our side to side roll axis balanced. We have our front to back pitch axis balanced. But we're not done with this side. We're not done with this motor, we're not done with this axis. What we have to do now is we have to balance the camera, the body, the height of the camera along this axis. And the way to find out if you're in balance or not, simply turn the camera facing up. As you can see here, the camera is falling forward. Now what this means is that there is way too much weight towards the bottom of the camera. This entire bottom half is a lot heavier than the top, so it's dragging the entire camera over. So what we need to do is we need to move this system up to find that balance point. And the way we do that, we unlock this screw here. Now a tip that I like to use when balancing the height is I like to place the camera at a 45 degree angle facing up. Now when the camera stays still in this position, you know that you found your balance. So. Let's go ahead and slide the entire base plate system up slowly and it looks like we have a balance there. Okay, let's lock that down. Now we're going to double check and make sure everything's balance. So what we want to do is we first we want to point the camera forward, make sure we're still balanced there. The roll axis is still balanced, the pitch axis is still balanced. Now we're going to tilt the camera up, make sure it holds its position, turn it at a 45 degree angle. Looks like we're all good there. But we're not done. We have one more axis that we have to balance and that is the yaw located on the bottom by this motor here. Now you'll see this, this knob will control, will open up the entire system. So when we balance this axis, you have to take into consideration the weight of the camera as well as the entire weight of this back piece here on the MS Pro. You're balancing everything, not just the camera. So the way we check our balance here is what I like to do is if the camera's facing forward, turn the camera over to its side. And what you'll do here now is you'll push the camera forward and you'll see which direction that the camera falls. So what I'm going to do here is just push, lean the camera over. And you see that the camera has fallen. Now I'll bring it back to zero, let go, and as you can see the camera is falling forward in the direction of the camera, like the lens is going this way. So that means that we have to slide this entire system back. So we will open this up here and we will grab the MS Pro from the back here and we will slowly pull that piece out. So once we do that, we will check our balance again. It's still falling forward, so we got to go further. Slowly. We'll lean it forward again. Better, but we're not quite there yet. A little bit more. I think this should do it here. There we go. It's not falling in either direction. We're perfectly still, we're balanced. So let's lock that down in place. 
reset everything, double check your balance if you'd like, and we're ready to go. So the only thing left for us to do is to turn on the MS Pro, lift it up, and we're ready to use it. Now for more information on the MS Pro or any other products, you can visit us at iCanCorp.com. My name is Julio Ramon. Thanks for watching.